students so we are back again with another video for science dlp year 4 i'm with shikutasha here before we starting our lesson don't forget to like share and to subscribe my channel let's continue so today we'll be looking at human breathing process so for human breathing process we'll be looking at uh, three pages page 26 27 28 in science dlp textbook of year 4 so students Human breathing process. As you can see, Faris is doing some physical exercise with his elder brother. While exercising, they breathe in fresh air. Let's follow the journey of air when Faris breathes. Okay, students. So, what will happen when we breathe? So, we are going to look at in the nose. So, the first um, part that Okay, the first pathway uh, that go through when air enter is with the nose. So, in the nose, you can see that. Okay, let's read this one. Hi, I am oxygen. My friends and I are inhaled in the nose, into the nose. So, blue color represent oxygen while the red color represent carbon dioxide. So, when you are inhaling, always have to remember when you are inhaling into the nose, uh, oxygen will be higher than the carbon dioxide will be that which means there will be more oxygen than carbon dioxide when you inhale it okay so it will go through the nose okay next one it will go through the um, trachea so during inhalation they will pass through trachea so during inhalation when you're breathing in uh, the number of oxygen inside the trachea the inhaled air will be higher while during exhalation you are breathing out the number of carbon dioxide will be much higher compared to oxygen so trachea you have no after nose the air will go through trachea okay so let's look at in the lung so once it has entered the nose and trachea the air will go to the lung okay so in the lungs you have to know that um, there will be gaseous exchange will happen so when inhaled air goes into the lungs so the uh, oxygen will carried into the lungs whereby the carbon dioxide will be carried out of the lungs which means oxygen will go to the inside the lungs and carbon dioxide will come out of the lungs so this exchange of gas which is uh, oxygen going inside the lung and carbon dioxide coming out of the lungs we call it gas exchange of gases so oxygen enters the lungs and carbon dioxide leaves the lungs so this carbon dioxide leaves right so this is the one will be carried uh, out uh, in the trachea and through the nose and it will breathe, it, breathe out okay so let's continue so we have to know that breathing is a process of inhaling and exhaling which means we're breathing in and we are breathing out breathing in we calling process of inhaling while breathing out we are calling process of exhaling so during breathing inhaling uh, the air will go through nose, oxygen will go through nose, trachea and will reach the lungs. So this will be the pathway, nose, trachea and lungs. So from the nose, trachea to the lungs, nose, trachea and the lungs. Whereas when exhaling, it will move uh, from lungs to trachea through nose, lungs trachea and nose so when we are exhaling we are carrying more carbon dioxide while we are inhaling we will be carrying uh, more oxygen because we need oxygen to breathe but we doesn't need, our body does not need uh, carbon dioxide so it will be carried out of our body so today's lesson is only this part it's a very simple lesson I hope you all understand uh, don't forget to share my video like and also subscribe thank you students